Hey guys, what's up? By Sectatron here from One Hive Gazette here with the next video, and this one is a live attack video. I'm gonna be trying to three star this base. It's a fresh hit. Uh, this clan looks like it's gonna be a farming war. They're not uh, looking like they're gonna put up too much of a fight against us. At least their bases aren't that good, and they're a little bit under leveled. Um, not gonna be a close war most likely, but it should um, produce some good attacks. And this base is not. You know, incredibly easy to three star. Even though it's kind of a anti two star layout, it still has the uh, the basics of an anti three. And um, I'm going to be using the clone spell to try to take it out. We'll see if the clone spell has merits. Possibly um, town hall ten. It can spawn six balloons, thirty two troop space. That equals six balloons. And one of the great things is you don't need six balloons. If there's just one balloon in the clone spell, it'll spawn. Uh, it'll duplicate itself six times. So. Um, should be cool to see how it works out. The plan is shockingly simple, especially for me with all my complicated plans. Basically just gonna drop a golem right here, my queen right behind, um, three minions right here to get these two taken out. Uh, I'll check this, but I'm pretty sure the air defense can't reach here. Um, also a baby dragon right here. Then when the time comes, I'll drop my jump my king and two valks poison um don't know what's in the cc it could be a hound it could not be either way i think we should be able to take care of uh whatever's in there i'm trying to get the inferno tower um the two archer towers the wizard tower the air defense possibly the air sweeper as well but the queen and the cc would also be nice maybe it's a bit of a stretch i don't know i could rage them up i don't think i'm going to i don't think it's necessary um, but, you know, I might pay for it. We'll see. Then the plan is just a Laloon around like this. Basically, um, two hounds dropping my loons. If the sweeper's still up, I'm going to have to use the haste around here to get the loons into these defenses. And then just continue around here. I have another two more hastes. I have the rage, um, which I'll probably use around this area. And also the clone spell which will be nice to get more balloons on the Inferno Tower if there's not enough on there for whatever reason. It makes it so I don't have to, you know, deploy them quite as much at the beginning. I can save some for the back end around here. And also it gives me some full health loons um, because this Wizard Tower, without a heal spell, can do some uh, solid damage. But the full health balloons should be able to come in there and really um, not be affected by that Wizard Tower very much. So... Let's go into Clash of Clans. That's the plan. Um, we'll see how it goes. Actually, I might bring a third Valk just to be safe. Um, better safe than sorry. Uh, let's go down to a third Valkyrie. I think I need to get rid of this Archer. Yeah. Just to be safe. Um, Want to make sure my kill squad gets the job done. And I'm not using the Rage. So, yeah. Going to use the, the third Valk. But besides that, everything looks good. I'll have a total of, I guess, 20, 21, then six, uh, 27 balloons. Um, so much more than it appears in my army camp, actually. And uh, we'll, we'll see about this. Um, see how the clone spell works out. But it looks like I have everything. I need to upgrade my haste spells. I know they, they should be level four. Um, I'm behind. I have to get the king to 40, the clone spell to four, in the heal spell to seven. A little bit of work ahead of me, but I've been farming more lately, so that's a good thing. Um, going into the war here, uh, base number 16, Eric. Let's give this one a spin. Um, yeah, I'm gonna drop the queen right around there. She should step up, take this stuff out, and then, yeah, air defense can't reach there. Okay, we're good. And... Let's do this. Okay, start off with the golem. One, two, three. Oh, baby dragon almost forgot. Let's get this jump ready. Oh, um, king. This is great. Okay. They're coming. They're coming. Let's get this poison ready right now. Okay. 
Oh, the queen's in there. That's good, at least. Pop her now. Get the inferno. Get the dragon. Need that defensive queen. Perfect. All right, let's get these loons going. And our hound. And our hound. And the first haste. Not the best deployment. There's the cloney. There's the haste. It's back end. Just gotta pray I have enough balloons. Get some minions in there. Get those air skellies taken out. Um, come on. Oh, God. All three expos still left up. This is an uphill battle if I've ever seen one. I got the clone spell balloons running out. Uh, no spells left. We're going to have to wait and see. I got stuff popping on me. I just need one balloon to fall on that last expo and it's not going to go down. Man, that baby dragon actually might be able to help me out here. Let's get that in the corner taken out. Um, yeah, time though. Time's an issue as well. And uh, nothing in the corner for there. I used all my minions up. That was a good idea. Um, not going to fly. Um, and that sucks because this base should have gone down. Should be a routine three star for a, a base with the air defenses kind of in the crappy positions they were in. But um, I guess, you know, people fail and that's just kind of how it works. Uh, we'll get this up to a one star about 93, 94 percent. So, uh, yeah, that'll do it, I guess. We'll take a look at the replay, see what happened here. Actually, maybe this will be a two-star. Nope, one-star. Um, that expo, so close to going down. Um, my balloon pathing was just terrible. Uh, going into that first expo, I needed to go stronger on these two defenses to push my balloons from that air defense into that expo and kind of keep them cutting across the core. That's one mistake is if you don't, um, if you have an isolated defense like this, you got to push your balloons in. You can't allow them to kind of meander out to, to around the base and ignore this defense because that that hurt. Then I wasted a total of four balloons trying to go in and take it out, and it still couldn't get that expo. Um, but anyway, the opening was good. I wasn't expecting that builder had to pull things, but honestly, it didn't matter that much. My kill squad got... Um, almost more value than I thought it would. Uh, incredible value from the kill squad. Shows the power of the queen when she enters the base and she doesn't get caught up in a lava hound. That dragon goes down um, almost like she's cutting through butter. It just goes down so easily, especially with the poison. Looks like he had a dragon, baby dragon, balloon combo, um, which really went down so quickly. Um, and then the king, the valves kind of get out, walk around, do their job. The queen sits back and finishes everything off. So the value could not have been better um, in that regard. And this one baby dragon actually goes around the entire base, which is uh, interesting. Yeah, I guess it just survived and went up around the entire base. But right here, um, needed to go stronger. I only dropped a few balloons here. Um, and that lava hound might have been a little bit late. I don't know. Um, yeah, I don't know. Just needed to go stronger to push those balloons into that expo. Because right here, it um, does not go down. I continue on with my deployment. I drop the rage, pretty good placement there. Um, I'm not the best at balloon deployment in case you haven't noticed. I'm more of a ground attack person, but you know, I, I'm trying to mix it up here. Uh, that haste looked good, keeping the balloons moving. Needed them to get into that last air defense. I dropped four balloons here, but looks like that expo with the range just takes them out one by one. The other expo gets on them as well. Only two balloons get drops off at first. And um, yeah, they're just not able to get the job done. That expo at about quarter to fifth health right there. And uh, able to get the next two expos taken out, but the distance between them is so long. Um, if I had just got the pathing a little bit better, this would have been a three star most likely, um, but couldn't quite get it to go and uh, not gonna fly. Guess the moral of the story is balloon pathing. That's really it. I gotta work on it for sure. That's one of my weaknesses. And um, got to take my own advice to a certain extent. Just got to keep 
use the additional balloons to keep your main force going. Don't let your balloons get clumped up. Um, use Get your reinforcements in early so they don't, they don't just join up with the main group, but they push the main group deeper into the base where you need them to go. Balloons spread out are better than balloons clumped up for the most part. So uh, that'll do it. Hope you guys like the video and maybe learn something. I'm sure a lot of you guys like seeing me fail more than seeing me uh, succeed, but that's fine. Uh, whatever you get from it. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Bisectatron out.